Hi everybody, I wanted to take a minute to kind of give you um, some helpful hints on working in the course modules. Um, so I'm going to go to course modules right here and I'm just going to open module 2 since that's the, one, that's the one we're currently working in. Now it's a little bit difficult, we have the table of contents over here and it's a little bit difficult to see all of the, the material that you know, all of the titles of all of the pages. It's kind of cut off there, and that can be a little bit confusing. So what I do when I'm working in a module, the first thing that I do is I hide the course menu just while I'm working in the module. So I'm going to click that, and it opens it up just a little bit more. Um, as you, you know, you click on all of these links to access the different materials that are, that, that you need to. Um, but it's still a little bit difficult to see. So a couple of things you can do. Right over here, you can expand the table of contents. That's going to make it just a little bit bigger, a little bit easier to read all of the titles. But what I do is I move it to the bottom here. And so I move the table of contents to the bottom, and then I am better able to see um, what it is I'm supposed to be working on over here. And just to remember, you know, these are all of the pages that you need to look at, that you need to work on in your module. Module 2 response paper is here. You need to be sure that you're clicking on all of these and, um, you know, making sure you're reading all of them, that you're working on all of the, the content that's in the table of content. We have it organized into, mod into reading. This is all the reading that you'll do. These are the video lectures, these are the mind tap exercises, these are the essay things that you need to be working on. All right, so um, hopefully that helps to clear up any confusion you might have about working in the course modules and where to find stuff. So everything you need for a particular course module is going to be listed here in the table of contents. And you can click around and, and find these um, you know, you can move around within the table of contents if you need to. These are mind tap exercises. If I click here and then click to launch, it's going to open that mind tap in a separate um, in a separate screen for me. So, hopefully that helps. If you have any questions, um, be, as as always, be sure to let me know.